Example two, solve using the substitution method. So we're gonna practice another example. So we need to isolate one of the variables in one of the equations. So again, I don't really wanna pick the two X or the four Y because I'd have to divide off and by then the seven isn't divisible. So um, I'm gonna pick this Y because it's already by itself. So I'm just gonna move that four X over. So we're gonna rewrite this as Y is equal to negative four X plus five. And so that means I'm gonna substitute this in for y in the second equation. So we're gonna have two x minus four times negative four x plus five equals seven. So instead of writing a y in this equation, since y equals this, we're plugging that in instead. Now you only have an x value in this equation to solve for. So you get two x plus 16 x minus 20 equals seven. 18x minus 20 equals 7, 18x equals 27, divide off the 18, and you're gonna reduce. We're gonna work with fractions, you would not have a calculator for this question. So I can see that nine is divisible by both, so this reduces down to three over two. So we're gonna use this fraction, no calculators, um, so de using it as a decimal is not gonna help us. Okay, so now I have to plug this into either one of the equations. Again, I think there's less work involved with the 4x plus y, so I'm going to choose the 4x plus y equals 5. So I'm just going to put a line down here. So this is sort of step two now is find y. So we're going to plug in 3 over 2 is x. So we get 4 times 3, so 12 divided by 2 is 6. We get six plus y equals five, move six to the other side, y is equal to negative one. So my ordered pair is three over two, comma, negative one. Make sure you put brackets around that. Let's verify one more time so that we can practice what that would look like with the uh, fraction. So when we're verifying the first equation of two x minus four y equals seven, we have two times three over two minus four, times negative one equals seven. So the twos just cancel out. So you have three plus four equals seven, seven equals seven. And now we're gonna check this equation, four x plus y equals five. So you're gonna get four times three over two plus negative one equals five. So we've done this calculation before. So 12 divided by two is six minus one equals five and five equals five.